Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey's relationship was one of the main talking points in the 2023-24 NFL season. The pop superstar and future first ballot Hall of Famer are the NFL's most prominent power couple and their relationship brought quite a few eyes to the gridiron. Taylor Swift is in Australia for her era's tour, following her Sunday trip to Las Vegas to watch her boyfriend help the Kansas City Chiefs win back-to-back -back Super Bowls. Travis Kelsey isn't currently in Australia. When asked if he would travel to Australia to support his Grammy Award-winning girlfriend, Kelsey said, I am not planning anything after the Super Bowl, I am just focused on this game right now. But I'd love to experience that only after. Many fans then took to social media to express their frustration at Taylor for caring for Travis so much which apparently he doesn't do same. One fan said she has always been the man in this relationship always present and trying to make things work. While he just seats there watching LOL. The majority of the world is having fun watching his love story with Swift play out in the public eye, the tight end said. Travis Kelsey is proud to have support from his superstar girlfriend, Taylor Swift. Kelsey, 34, opened up about how the couple maintain their privacy despite their celebrity status on Wednesday's episode of The Pat McAfee Show. Kansas City star tight end said, It's a beautiful thing, isn't it? Hopefully, everybody realizes we're just two people supporting each other and having fun with it, man. Kelsey continued, It's nothing more than that and how much the world wants to paint the picture and make us the enemy, we just have fun with it and we enjoy every single bit of it. With Swift becoming a celebrated member of Chiefs Kingdom after regularly supporting the team at games throughout the season, Kelsey gushed over the singer finding time to attend games despite her ultra-packed schedule. I love it when Taylor comes and supports me and enjoys the game with the fam and friends, Kelsey said. It's been nothing but a wonderful year, man. Kelsey said he and Swift are aware of the NFL purists who criticize the league's coverage of the singer during games and that Swift has dealt with similar negativity forever. We hear it, but we hardly ever talk about it, Kelsey said, brushing off the digital toxicity by calling hateful comments, nothing to even talk about, nothing to really bring up. Looking back on having his girlfriend by his side throughout the NFL season, Kelsey said the experience was brand new for him, citing having the paparazzi follow me every single day into work and everybody having my name on their talk show. As elements of the media frenzy he's learned to adapt to while dating Swift. You know, it's been a crazy, crazy ride that I could have never anticipated Kelsey shared. But I'm having fun with it. The majority of the world is having fun with it, outside all the cranky NFL fans that just don't want to see the Chiefs win, he added. Still, Kelsey joked that he and Swift are slowly winning over the naysayers. You know what, we're slowly reeling them in. They're fighting it right now, he joked. After the Chiefs won the AFC Championship game in Baltimore on Sunday, Swift joined him on the field to congratulate him and he and the pop star shared several sweet moments together. The couple shared several kisses and the NFL star was heard saying, I love you, during the celebrations in Baltimore. During the AFC Championship ceremony at MNT Bank Stadium, the NFL star's parents, Ed and Donna Kelsey, and his brother, Jason Kelsey, joined him and Swift on the field. On Wednesday's episode of New Heights with Jason and Travis Kelsey, Travis said to his brother, shout out to Tay, thanks for joining the team, after Jason, 36, joked that Swift had reached the Super Bowl in her rookie year. It was so fun seeing you guys afterwards hanging around to see us raise that Lamar Hunt trophy yet again, Travis said. We had the whole family down on the field, Jason recalled. We had me mom, dad, and Taylor. Everybody was down there. Among the other sweet moments the couple shared on the field included several kisses and embraces and the NFL star switched up his usual Tay nickname to call the singer Sweetie in a video captured and circulated online.